Upper cervical care is a radically different approach to health care. It's natural. And to fully understand the concept, we want to introduce you to all the players, the body parts, the way the nerve system operates, and all the systems in your body that function so you can better understand how it works. And, you know, upper cervical doctors, their main focus are these top two bones of your spine called the atlas and the axis. Atlas and axis. They sound very similar, but keep it straight this way. You know the Greek mythology figure, Atlas, holding up the world? Atlas is holding up your world, the brain. Axis is so-called because the head and the atlas pivot around the axis. The remainder of the spine, from the low back all the way up to the mid-neck region, has interlocking joints that limit how far the bones can move. But ironically enough, the atlas and axis, the top two, are not shaped the same way. They don't have the same bony locks. And the segments are, are held in place by muscles and ligaments. And so as a result, it's a more unstable area. And that's, of course, what gives us a tremendous amount of mobility we have in the neck area. The problem is, with that increased mobility, it does us, make us more susceptible to injury in that area. The part of your nerve system that connects the brain to the rest of your body is called the brain stem, and that controls this healing process, the healing communication from your body to your brain. Now, the trick to this whole system is that the brain stem flows through those top two bones in your spine, the atlas and the axis. One of the upper two bones in your neck can get misaligned to the point two things happen. One, it actually can squeeze down on the brain stem. When that happens, the normal nerve transmissions and the healing mental impulses that go from your brain to every part of your heart, liver, lungs, kidneys, arms, legs, even back up into the head, face, and neck, those messages can get interfered with. If that happens, then wherever those messages were intended to go will cause that part of the body to malfunction, possibly even shut down altogether. That's when people get sick, disease sets in. So the main goal of upper cervical care is to remove any interference on that nerve system so that your body can operate at its very best and heal itself from the top down, inside out. We're not treating you for a certain condition. We're removing interference so that your body can heal itself, get itself back to normal function, whatever that condition is, that can get back to normal function and you're healed. Do we as upper cervical doctors, do we treat diabetes? No. Legally, we can't even say we treat conditions, but we treat the body, okay? We correct the cause of the problem. We don't treat the problem. That's the problem with the healthcare system today is that they spend so much time chasing symptoms, chasing diseases, when all healing resides within you. And if we can just remove the interference in that healing process, then the body will heal on its own. That's what upper cervical is all about. So you see how radically different this style of healthcare is? You know, the concept is simple, it's completely natural, and amazingly, it can aid in the powerful, innate healing and wellness process that your body goes through to combat disease and ailments and any problems that you're having in any part of your body, from the top of your head to the soles of your feet. There's hope. There's hope for people that have been suffering. There's hope for people that have been sick for years. There's hope for people that have been told there's nothing else that can be done. Upper cervical, chiropractic, Save my life.